Happy bank holiday weekend. I hope you're keeping well. I wanted to quickly talk to you about breathing and breathing exercises. Um, We all know how important deep breathing is for our um, well-being and reducing anxiety, but it's also really important for reducing pressure on our neck. So um, quite often when we are shallow breathing, we tend to use the muscles that attach into our neck that are designed primarily for actually moving our neck and secondarily for being accessory muscles of breathing but for short sharp periods not for long periods of time but quite often we get into this habit of shallow breathing and that puts a lot of extra pressure on these muscles um so i want to give you two exercises to help you recruit your diaphragm which is a big muscle at the base of the lungs and every time you take a big deep breath in what what should happen is the lungs should fill up your diaphragm drops down abdominal contents come out um and as you breathe out the abdominal contents come back in again, diaphragm lifts up, uh, lungs reduce uh, down in size. Um, And so we want to try and uh, use our diaphragm because it's a huge big muscle and that's what it's designed to do. So um, first exercise is quite simple, put one hand on your chest, one hand on your abdomen and just feel the breathing. And as you take a nice deep breath in, see which hand moves more. What you're trying to encourage is your abdominal hand to move more and you want this hand to move much less. Um, the second exercise is to hold your um, sort of tummy side by side, side either side. And what you do is, um, as you take a nice deep breath in, feel your hands separate. And as you breathe out, feel them contract back together again. Um, this is a great exercise for just focusing on the diaphragm itself, but also to remind yourself of how much space you've got to breathe. Um, I hope those exercises help. Um, I hope you have a lovely weekend. Take care.